Felipe Anderson, nice touch for Vecino. We've played one of the three added minutes. Isaacson gives chase. He'll probably catch it too. Isaacson's done well. Illing Jr. lets it bounce and got there ahead of Genduzi. Nice touch that by Sekulov. Juventus with a little bit of ambition finally in this second half. Sekulov. And Danilo turns back towards his own goal. Rabiot. Illing Jr. Danilo's lost it, but it doesn't break the way of Luis Alberto. Szczesny with the clearance. Marusic will deal with it very easily for his goalkeeper, but Mandas is certainly enjoying himself. He got a clean sheet on his Lazio debut in the cup against Roma. It's looking like a shutout tonight against another of the big boys, Juventus, unless McKenney. Locatelli. Yildiz on the half turn. Vecino won the sliding challenge and needed to as well. We're into the final minute of added time. Rabio Sekulov with the touch. Romagnoli's there to pick up the loose ball. Felipe Anderson. Isaacson in space. Instead, it's through towards Immobile. Can Bremer catch him? Immobile was caught by Bremer and comfortably. Just an arm on the shoulder from the Brazilian, who's now lost possession. Just wonder whether the better ball might have been the other side towards Isaacson as opposed to Immobile. Luis Alberto, Tudor, urging his team forward in search of a winner. Luis Alberto. Felipe Anderson, Lazio outnumbered in the box. So many black shirts in the penalty area. Genduzi. Still Genduzi. There's Marusic! With the final moment of the game. His first goal in two years. And Adam Marusic does follow up his goal with Montenegro with the winner for Igor Tudor in his first match in charge. It is a reward for their persistence. It is a reward for their attacking ambition. And Lazio have beaten Juventus with the last kick of the game. And you say it well, Patrick, because they deserve that, that reward. Because they did well, Juventus played too low, in, especially in the second half. You see again, too easy for him to deliver that ball inside the box. Too late, that challenge, but a great, great ball anyway, delivery inside the box by Gwen Duzi that find the space and Marusic feel that space, attack. The new, the new one inside, inside for Juventus and he scored a great goal, great goal by Marusic and Lazio deserve to win this match, 1-0. The two-door effect, there it is, what a moment for him, his first match in charge, an added time winner in front of the Kurvanod from a player who hadn't scored for the club for two years, Igor Tudor making an immediate mark on the Bianco Celesti bench and Juventus who were playing out for a goalless draw had been made to pay for their passive approach. And it is the Lazio supporters who celebrate a return to form. They left it late. They couldn't have left it much later. But Easter Saturday has just taken a very positive turn for the Bianco Celesti. There is no time left. It was the penultimate touch of the game. Igor Tudor was brave. His players followed his game plan to the letter. A clean sheet for Mandas and a winning goal for Marusic. That was the formula that saw off Juventus. It now becomes a full-on crisis for the Bianconeri. But Igor Tudor, having got the better of the club where he played many years ago, will go up against the Bianconeri again in three days' time in the Cup. But Juventus are out of sorts, out of form. Lazio might be on the way back. Full-time score at the Stadio Olimpico. Lazio 1, Juventus 0.